Welcome to our channel Networking with Guruji. What, why, how? In this series, today we will discuss Ether Channel. What is Ether Channel? Ether Channel is a port link aggregation technology in which multiple physical port links are grouped into one logical link. It is used to provide high speed links and redundancy. A maximum of 8 links can be aggregated to form a single logical link. Why do we need Ether Channel? Increased bandwidth. By combining multiple physical links into single logical link, Ether Channel provides increased bandwidth between switches. This can help improve network performance and reduce bottlenecks. Improved redundancy. Ether Channel provides improved redundancy by allowing traffic to be routed over multiple physical links. If one link fails, Traffic is automatically routed over the remaining links. Load balancing. Ether channel distributes traffic across multiple physical links, providing improved load balancing and preventing congestion on any one link. Simplified network configuration. Ether channel simplifies network configuration by treating multiple physical links as a single logical link. This can reduce the complexity of network configuration and make troubleshooting easier. Cost effective. Ether channel can be a cost effective way to increase bandwidth and redundancy in a network as it allows existing physical links to be used rather than requiring new hardware. How do we configure Ether channel? So, there is certain criteria to form an Ether channel. All ports should have same speed and duplex settings. Switch port mode should be the same. It should be access or trunk mode. Same VLAN configuration that is native VLAN and allowed VLAN should be same on trunk ports. Now in the picture we can see the status of the ports when we haven't did the ether channel configuration. So here we are using the four ports fast ethernet one to four. So only one port is active rest is unable or disable to do the ether channel configuration we go to the global configuration mode then the interface range fa0 slash 1 to 4 channel group 12 mode desirable so this 12 will come as an our port channel number so in the next picture we can see if we see the show ip interface brief we can see we have the port channel 12. Similar configuration we will do on the next switch also. And now we can see we have the port channel 12. And parallel also our four interfaces are up. After completing the ether channel configuration, now we can see our switches. All four physical links are up. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, share and subscribe.